One Tuscaloosa County teacher wants to make sure she has the tools she needs to teach her students. I had the pleasure to meet this week's One Class at a Time grant winner to see how she plans to use the new money to help her students experience in her art classes. Not every circle has to overlap. It can be one solid. These students are part of the Tuscaloosa Fine Arts Academy, hosted at Paul W. Bryant High School. Their teacher, Natalie Roy McKnight, already teaches fashion as a part of the curriculum, but she says the class could really use some additional supplies. When it comes to purchasing supplies and stuff like that, you know, sewing machines and mannequins, they're pretty expensive. So we surprised Miss Roy McKnight with some extra funds to help her better equip her art classroom. Hi. CBS 42 and Eco Credit Union want to give you this $1,000 grant from one class at a time, and we're excited for you. Congratulations. Oh, thank you. <laughs> now she can purchase the extra supplies she needs so her students can get the most out of their classes. The one thing that I wanted to do was be able to have a real experience in the fashion industry with making clothes, and the $1,000 would help us with getting fabric and mannequins and sewing machines possibly into the classroom for them. I want to thank CBS 42 and the Eco Credit Union for giving me this opportunity to provide a better future for my students. Great to meet Ms. Roy McKnight. If you're a teacher who would like to apply for a one class at a time grant, don't forget you can go to cbs42.com, click on Living Local, and then one class at a time.